Heather was absolutely right, but first, check out our little tour of this weird place in Georgia. Hello! Fancy seeing you here. Welcome to my vacation house. Should I do the finger bangs or should I do a twirl and finger bang? No, see so your mischief making Heather. Do that little swirl that Fun Maker Mike does. Golly gee, it's Mischief Maker Heather here. There you go, Heather. Perfect. Am I really copying Fun Maker Mike? Yep. He is a lot of fun. I cannot be as fun as him. So this um, is my living room that you've just entered. It is very nice. I have a very nice smart TV. You want to know what's really cool? They greeted us with a black metal ghastly. I'm just kidding. I brought that along. Here I have a fake plant, but I also have a real plant and some yarn coasters. Right here is where I like to sit. Right here is where Chris likes to shit. But for real, this is the bathroom. We have, this is bathroom number one. We're right here. No, come here, camera guy, look. This is where I sleep. Can you believe it? In our big mess. Yeah, well, your big mess. Mine is very neatly in the corner. You're very messy. You're messy your today. suitcase You're is You're vomiting all over the You're floor. Gross. Very gross. And look, I have a blanket with my dog on it. <laughs> That's Brittany, bitch. I hate that to say is this. Brittany. Hate to say this, but my dog's been on it too. <laughs> Ew! So here's another place where I like to sit. Except I'm lying. I don't like to sit here and let me show you why. As you can see, there's like hand marks. And my guess is someone just like patted it down. But right there, don't know what that is. Don't want to find out. Here's Sonoy. It's a picture of Sonoy. Ooh, that's which is cool. what we're saying, yeah. How much I gotta pay you to put your tongue on that? Okay. If you follow me in here, this oh up. Oh. Hold on. I don't know how to work these lights. There's a lot of lights. <laughs> this is my kitchen. Stove. We have a microwave over there. It's really weird that it's over there, but it's over there. This was definitely an older house for sure. Yeah. Because it has, see this like the- Stucco? Yeah, the stucco ceiling. Um, right here, it says just peachy because we are in Georgia. And then if you come in here, room and this is where I did some laundry and then this is where I've been putting the towels when we're done with them now here is great it's our backyard and we have a charcoal grill and back there I don't know what that is but I think it's a gas grill okay I was gonna say it looks like a large tombstone it looks like a very big stone I don't know what it is and then we have this like odd little conversation set and if you want to follow me another bedroom very nice very comfortable beds television all of them are smart tvs which i love love it hold on let me show you the best part we have games Ooh. yeah we have a whole I am horse <laughs> that's really weird what we is i am horse anyway it's a puzzle it's shaped like the horse's head I am horse. That's weird to call that, isn't it? Isn't that <laughs> so then right here is bathroom number two, which I used this morning to do my hair. Oh my God, you were in here too? Well, I didn't want to wake you up since the other bathroom's inside the bedroom. Oh my God. Yeah, so I did, I blue dried my hair in here. Then in here, another comfortable bed. And this says life is beautiful. And I think that's great. And that's it. Oh, that's a loud fan. All right, are you ready to talk about Funko News? I guess. You're always right. And here's how I'm going to prove that you're always right. These Funko anime things, the Funime, these guys, they're not actual anime characters. Yeah, they're not licensed. And what did you say? That they're not going to be you licensed. You said they were not going to be licensed, and you were absolutely right. But... I would like to say 
that I think they are very cool. They are cool. I like them. I'm glad they went this route at first. Maybe they'll eventually go and do something with actual anime licenses. Do you but think, for now, that's pretty cool. Do you think this is them trying to get anime licenses for NFTs? Like they Maybe. might be using it to go back to the anime like licensors and say, hey. Look how well they did. Yeah. But uh, maybe. Honestly, I don't think these are going to do very well. If you don't it, think so? No, I don't. I, I mean, do it, well. if they might do okay. I think that the, what is it, the Mega Pack or whatever, that'll sell out. Yeah, there's like. there's only 499. What's it called? It's called like the something, something pack. It's Mega or Monstrous or something. Oh, Ma Mega, Mega something. All right, so there's a Ramen Freddy that I really happen to adore. I like that he's eating his little ramen. Heather and I eat ramen all the time, so I like that. Fun Force Freddy. Yeah. Wasn't there a Funko Force character? Funko Force? No, Funko, Funko Force, Force was, was like. Funko the, Force was the before Funko Pop. Pops, yeah. Okay, so. Fun, oh, I'm sorry, it's Fun Force Freddy. Fun Force Freddy. So he looks kind of cool. He reminds me of like Ultraman or something. You know who Ultraman is? Yeah. You don't know who Ultraman is, do you? Yes, I do. Then there's Celestial Franny. So they are including Franny in this set, which is fun. I and like that. And then there's Kitsune Mask Franny. So we have two Frannies. So we're getting all sorts of Frannies. Then there's Kaiju Proto and Ultimate Freddy, where Ultimate Freddy is like sort of blasting something out of his little hands. Kind of like Goku or Ryu from Street Fighter. He has like a power blast coming out of his hands. See him? Mm-hmm. Any cool? Yeah, that's great. The Kaiju Proto is my favorite. He is the Grail. I think he's the best one out of all these. You know what a Kaiju is? Mm -mm. Kaiju is like a big creature, like a big monster like Godzilla. Oh, okay. So he, if, I don't know if you noticed, but in this picture, he's actually, I can't blow it up, but he's holding buildings. Oh, okay. Yeah, yeah. That's cool. Isn't that cool? Do you like these? Do you think they're garbage? Go ahead and be honest. I think they're cool, but think they're cool? I, I don't think they're anything that I really care about. One thing that I do care a lot about is that. Whoa, Heather. I really like that. The evil queen, or not evil queen, um, what is witch. it? The witch, the witch? Yeah. The witch, From black Snow. light? That's cool, that's a cool Vanka Pop. Yeah, it, says, it says black light evil queen, disguised evil queen. Yeah. With raven. That is, that is the evil queen, but she's a She's, she's a witch. raven. Yeah, or, or has a raven. Yeah. Not she has a raven. Oh, she actually comes with like a buddy raven. That's really cool. But what I wanted to look at is what what that thing was called. Because that's been going around. Here it is. Better pictures of the Mech Freddy, which is in that special box. The Mythic Pack. Mythic. Uh, mythic. Yeah, 10 not inch, Mega. 10 inch. And the packs cost $130. And it means that you'll actually get this thing. I don't know how popular it is. I noticed like some of the comments, people were meh. I look in here on disc trackers, people are like, I'm in, looks great. I want it, need Gundam pops now, NFT, I don't know why that person, they just said NFT redeemable. How damaged is the box arriving? That's a good question. Cool, but no thanks. They can't even send a normal pop without damage, fair. I'm, I'm excited about them. Again, I'm not an anime fan. By the way, this was shared by a nerdy dad. Go and follow him. Uh, he has a really great Instagram with a bunch of news. Typically has some, has some really great leaks as well, as well as disc trackers and, and a lot of the other guys. But a nerdy dad always comes through with some really cool stuff. So something was shared with us that was really weird, and we didn't even know if we wanted to talk about it or not, but it's about CCXP, which is taking place in Mexico City right now as we speak. There are Funko Pops there that have been shared, I think, already through like other conventions or have been Funko exclusives or what have you. But in any event, they have a brand new sticker on them. They say CCXP. So this video that was shared with us w was from an influencer with two other influencers and Mike Becker, Funmaker Mike. And in this video, the influencers are basically saying, we are reliable sources or trusted sources Buy these Funko Pops from us. We have secured them. You're going to want them because these stickers are on there. And Mike Becker is in this whole entire video. In fact, he opens the video uh, like he normally does. His jolly, was it golly, golly G? And he does his little spin thing. And it's for an influencer's page. It isn't a Mike Becker video. 
it's a influencer video and Mike Becker just happens to be in it. And when they mention that they're selling the Funko Pops with the stickers on them and we're reliable sources, so reach out to us, Mike Becker looked like he just saw a ghost. Like he <laughs> does not look like he understood or knew what he was getting himself into. Yeah, it's almost like they were like, hey, Fun Mike or Mike, be in my video. And he didn't know he was going to be on like a commercial. Yeah, yeah, basically. Yeah, like a, I don't want to say a flipper video, but I mean, that's basically kind of what it is. I captured Mike's yeah. face. Oh, yeah, here's his face. As soon as they start talking about buy this, like contact me and I'll get it for you. I'll hook you up. Look. <laughs> <laughs> that is a face of a person who had no idea what he was getting into. <laughs> and he's like, oh, okay. Yeah, he is He is shocked <laughs> and confused and um, like, wow, uh, golly gee, what did I get myself into? No, golly gee. I stepped in some pee. I don't no, know. No, he did. What? I don't know. I'm just, you know. I, anyway, we didn't know if we were going to talk about this or not. It was shared with us. I don't want to name the person who shared it with us because they basically were like, hey, check this video out. And I watched it, but I was in the middle of a restaurant. By the way, we're going to post a video of this restaurant. It's a Chick-fil-A that's uh, uh, Hawaiian themed. It was so cool. It's You're going to want to see it. Yeah. It's so cool. But uh, they messaged it to me, and the only thing that I captured was them talking about, the influencers talking about the stickers, and how, oh, you're going to want this sticker. And I res responded back, and I was like, ha, 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 stickers, because I thought the CCXP, who cared? Like, I don't care about that. Like, I thought that was a joke. And they came back, and they're like, no, what about the people in the video trying to sell stuff with Mike Becker in the video? And I was like, what? And I went back, and I rewatched it, listening to it, and I'm like, holy crap. That is unbelievable. That's the same thing, like, if, if Heather and I were at New York Comic Con and we got Mike Becker into a video and just to be like, hey, we're, look who we're with or whatever, and then we're like, buy Mischief Toys gear right now. Yeah, then Mike Becker's in the background. He's looking no. like this? No, hold on, I'll, I'll tell you what he's looking like. <laughs> That's my favorite. Hey, hey, hey guys. Golly gee, it's Fun Maker Mike here and Heather and Chris, the Gasso Cast. Yay! Oh, hey, um, buy Mischief Toys. <laughs> That's so funny. That's so ridiculous. Look at that face. He he has no idea what happened. <laughs> so, he had no idea what happened. You know, that's, that's our guess, at least. That's the same it's face funny. that those birds. You ever see the videos of it's like it's like a um, like a ring camera like attached to a home, and a bird looks into it, and he does like does like this. <laughs> yeah. That's exactly the look that he's making in that. Huh? Yeah, he has no idea what's going on. So I don't know what that's about. I feel like you caught Mike Becker off guard, possibly. I'm just not sure. But that was really weird. It could have been explained. You know, what it could be, though, is Mike just doesn't know what to do with himself when he's not talking. So we've been on vacation, and anytime you've told me to pose somewhere, like, I don't know what to do with my hands. Like, maybe Mike just doesn't know yeah, what the, to do the, with his face. To, right, right, right. But this is the equivalent of being at, like, New York Comic Con in a video with Mike Becker and saying, oh, I bought New York Comic Con exclusive Funko Pops. You want them. I'm selling them. Well, like, yeah, that's exactly what it is. Except that's what I'm saying. It's really, it's really weird. I've never seen anything like that before. It's funny. And you roped in the founder of the company. I mean, that's just crazy. I, I, I don't know. I still can't wrap my head around it. I got to talk about this probably. Maybe we'll talk about it down the line. I don't know. And I cannot share that video here. I, I don't want to bring up who those people are. I don't want to out out them, I guess, because I, I don't want to be a You'll probably see it. You'll probably yeah, you'll see it. You'll probably see it somewhere. No, we're not, I don't think we're being jerks. I just think it's, I think it's fun. No, no, I'm saying I don't want to be a jerk. Yeah. Yeah. I, I, don't, I don't think we are. Yeah. It is weird. Anyway, look, <laughs> that's all we have to say. Those anime Funko Pops are pretty cool. This is the place that we're staying here in Georgia, and we'll be on our way home very soon. Yeah. The trip is coming to an end. It's very sad. Thank you for watching, and thank you to all of our patrons. You guys are amazing. As I mentioned before, we can't show your names here because the thing's all screwed up. Thank you to all of our patrons. Thank you for understanding and hanging with us, and we'll be back in the chairs and the seats, the hot seats, next week. We'll be back home. And then tomorrow, look out for our brand new video where, or actually, not a brand new video. It's a video about our engagement. Yeah. Which many of you may have not ever watched. We're going to have a front and back bumper to the video where we talk a little bit about our engagement and, and all that kind of fun stuff. And I think you guys will really enjoy it. Um, the video means a lot to me and Heather. 
but the video looks like crap in comparison to what we do today because we were stiff as a board where we were cardboard cutouts of ourselves and we've come a long way since then but please enjoy it and watch it and uh, come back tomorrow and check that out also check out that video about the hawaiian themed chick-fil-a i think that'll be posted tomorrow as well so look out for that it's really really cool very cool yeah but um, thank you guys we appreciate you we'll see you in the next one bye Thank <laughs> you.